Hi there, just going to take us a walk around this 120 amp hour BMW i3. It's a 120 amp hour i3, uh, giving it around right about, I don't know, up to about 180 miles worth of driving range, depending on your drive style and time of year, maybe even a little bit more. Um, particular stats on this car, it's got 40,000 miles on the clock. Uh, let's have a look. Uh, next service is not due until the middle of March next year. And it's going to be going out with a fresh MOT, so it's not going to need another MOT until June 2024. So yeah, nothing to worry about for ages on this car. Um, this is really nice, it's got some nice spec, uh, and it's coming in at an incredibly good value, approachable price point uh, for a car of this sort of style and, uh, and driving performance. I'm just going to go around the car and I'll, I'll quickly point out any, any little minor noteworthy marks. There isn't a great deal to point out, and what there is is, is really quite... Quite tiny, quite minor, but um, no matter how small, make sure you draw your attention to it. Very nice imperial blue colour. Um, the alloys are all nice on that side. Some minor markings and very light sort of scratchiness on the boot sill. However, it's actually pretty good for a BMW i3. They, they all have it. It's paint on plastic, the same load height as the interior of the boot. Uh, but they're, like I say, if anything, that's quite good for a BMW i3. So I wouldn't be unduly worried about that. A bit of a squeeze around there, but you know what, that alloy was also fine. Very minor, sort of light, sort of scratch mark there on the passenger side front wing. You know, I'm sure we're going to see the odd sort of stone chip or two uh, on the, the bonnet and the bumper. Nothing particularly stands out. It's a couple of stone chips there, I suppose, on the on that little stone chip there on the bumper. But not a lot, you know, exterior wise. The condition's actually very good. A couple of minor, minor little marks, but certainly nothing to worry about. And you've got the, the sweet interior, so it's the top spec, most expensive interior. So it's full sort of truffle coloured brown leather. Um, you know, there's a little bit of wear and marking on the on the, the driver's seat. But again, nothing too untoward. Walnut dash. Um, you've also got the upgrade of the sunroof. That's a very desirable, nice thing to have. That's lovely. A little bit of a little bit of wear on the wood on the dash there. To be fair, I think probably a little bit of um, furniture oil will probably uh, bring that back. Uh, and everything looks all right in the, in the rear. Yeah, all good condition. So, so yeah, nice. It's nice to have this car with leather and a sunroof at this kind of price point. Excuse me, I have a world guys that goes in the front, so there's a front where that goes, I'll put that in there. Um, it's a bit of a stain on the plastic in the boot, so the boot's obviously been well used. It's actually a nice practical boot. With the seat's folded down, you've got a really nice big sort of flat uh, voluminous load space. Uh, and in that boot we'll of course be putting a three pin charging lead like we do with all our cars. So it will come supplied with a lead that you can plug into any normal main socket so you can charge the car from that. So you don't even necessarily need to get a charge point installed. And there you have it. If you're looking for a, 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 a big battery BMW i3 with some very nice spec on it with that interior and that sunroof at a really, really good value price point and this could well be the ideal car for you. Um, it's here on the forecourt, ready for a test drive or a viewing. Uh, alternatively, we can deliver this car straight to your home. Thank you very much for watching. Be sure to um, check out our, uh, our BMW i3 content on our website and our YouTube channel. Hopefully you'll find those videos helpful and hopefully we'll speak to you soon.